We're joined by Callie Sowland of Wasserman Boxing. Uh, Callie, uh, what can you tell us? Well, uh, it's obviously extremely disappointing to be standing here now um, at, at this stage and um, so close to the fight. Uh, spent the morning with Junior. Um, he is uh, absolutely devastated. He was ready to fight. Yeah. Uh, he was on weight. Um, same, I guess, goes for everyone who uh, was on that card, the undercard from top to bottom. Uh, it's been a, a huge camp for Chris um, under very difficult circumstances. So he is uh, absolutely devastated. Um, as I said, ready to fight on weight. Um, in the last 24 hours, um, matters really taken out of our hand. The handling of it um, was, I think, uh, yeah, it wasn't correct. Yeah. Um, and our attention now turns to uh, rescheduling the event. I can see you're, you're bitterly disappointed, obviously. Um, how close were we to the fight going on? Well, I'm a promoter, so you know we move on to the event next week. The difference is for the fighters, for for Chris and everyone else on the card, um, is he, you know he's gone through a training camp. Like everyone knows, it was a very difficult circumstances, and you know, I'm disappointed, but it's not where where he is right now. Um, and so I think that's the, the message I'd make now. You mentioned rescheduling the fight. Obviously, it's been postponed as opposed to being completely cancelled. When will we know potentially when that fight could go again? That's something that we will look at uh, very quickly um, and be back to you. What's the mood from Chris like? Obviously, look, he's done so well in promoting this fight. You know, I, I've spent time with him. Um, what's the mood of him right now? Uh, disappointment. He was ready to go. Um, and uh, I can't really say more than that right now. You have a number of fighters finding, sorry, Kelly, you have a number of fighters on the undercard. Um, is it looking at dates for them now as well? Because obviously a lot of these fighters, they don't fight, they don't get paid. Is it looking at dates for them? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's getting paid. It's career development. It's a number of aspects, uh, especially the ones that we uh, had out on the undercard. It's, you know, uh, Harlem Eubank, Lyndon Arthur, Chloe Watson, Matty Harris. Uh, you know, they're all uh, on the cusp of, of going to big things. And, of course, being on a big stage like Saturday would be a huge disappointment. Um, luckily, we have a enough dates, events to make sure that they're all uh, occupied. And But of course, you know, it's, there's no disguise in the fact this is a, this was a monster event this weekend. It was a huge platform for everyone on that undercard as well. Yeah, no, absolutely. It's, uh, it's abs gutting. Because you mentioned it as a monster event, is it, does that mean it has to happen again? Well, we definitely see it. I mean, as I said, we're working on the rescheduling. Um, you know, that's, that's all I can say right now. Kelly, thanks for joining us. Really appreciate it. Thank you.